this how strong a turtle is. He has a shell, and he has his body inside the shell. And, and the turtle, he is really smart. And when he wants to turn over, he uses his strength, his feet, his hands, and his head. When he gets tired, he stops. Then continues on. Mind, body, and soul. He's gonna do it. There you go, baby. Yeah, see? That's why we have a body. Soul, not soul. God gave us that shell. That shell don't last forever. God knows that these turtles are like, their bodies are like forever. They're very smart. See, they even listen to me. Say, what, what's that, what's that lady talking about? No, I'm just kidding. They really do. They listen. Right, guys? They're really a good pet to have. Especially if you take care of them, they'll last forever. These guys, they're so spoiled, they got their own room. They have a towel that they hibernate in. And they, I put them in the kitchen sink so that they can eat. It's a lot cleaner than putting them in a fish tank. A fish tank, it gets dirty. You can use that oxygen uh, thingamajiggy. And the oxygen does not work to keep it clean. But by them having their own little room and their meat put them in the sink and clean water every day or every other day because really they don't have to eat for two days, two or three days. But these guys are spoiled. I go, I go on the second day and I'm like, oh my goodness, I didn't feed them. But I've gotten used to not feeding them uh, every day. Before I was feeding them every day, three times a day, thinking they were starving to death. But then I realized when I read the uh, back of the turtle food that I was overfeeding them. So we've got Jenna, we've got uh, Savannah, we've got Tyler, and we've got Colby. The three, four turtles. Okay, well, just wanted to show you these beautiful turtles that are my little best friends. <laughs>